first uh, we have uh, our one screen here in our application i will show how uh, this is work a gallery uh, screen one screen two screen three we have taken three screens here first uh, after that we have added gallery by using single button we are navigating to three screen or multiple you can do uh, i will show in demo this uh, here also we set one variable uh, to show the property how it's work okay color also let's check this color is changing on the active screen 3 is present navigate screen 3 color also changes we go screen 2 here also color is changes that's all about uh, we uh, let's see how uh, we can do this from blank set okay uh, let's uh, make it blank We add one button here. Let's uh, make it small so we can arrange our button here. Okay, uh, now is sufficient. On galleries, on select property, we have to create one table by using table function. So we create one table. Table. Sorry. Table. For that uh, record means what we have to create. Let's create one record. First we give a screen name. Screen name. Equal to app. Let's give you button name, uh, navigation name, uh, menu, uh, let's give menu name to Screen one. We have to navigate it to screen one. That's why we give one name to navigate to screen one here. Okay. This is a text property. That's why we have to do the double colon here. Uh, let's format this. We copy this. Okay. Uh, Let's give here one comma, add comma, and okay, third. It's okay. Now we get to here we give name. Now we get to screen one. Now we get to screen two. And here now we get to screen three. Done. Let's we add some screen here. Okay. Add one scenario screen. Let's add. Uh, we added three screen. We give uh, change our name of the screen uh, of active, active screen. Okay, to screen one. Screen one. Here we change this to. Screen two. Here I uh, will change this name to screen three. Okay. Yeah, copy that. Now on button text property, we have to go here. Text display. You know this, this item not screen two. Not sorry.
this item dot menu name is here now we have to navigate it we are on select property of this we have to implement one formula let's see one on select We get on the fill property of this screen. Okay, we go on fill property of button. At the fill property, we have to change this color. This means. Uh, we changing the color if we apply if condition if this item of screen equal to app dot active screen then color is orange if it is not it will be blue screen. color means previous color that's all uh, let's we copy this gallery go here Okay. We change the name here. Okay. Here. Here. Screen two. Uh, let's we add one button here also. So we can hamburger icon. Change the color of this to white. Make it white. Select. This is the one variable here. Click. Add. So, comma, the mentor may copy this. In this visible property. Okay, on visible property of the gallery, we set that variable. So, done. We show how it's work now. 